residents of different parts of the country woke up today to a shock after the streets were filled by armed police. However, in some areas, protesters did not let fear hold them back, and rather they marched out in numbers to demonstrate and demand better governance in the country. Meanwhile, two people, including a child, were shot dead in Ongatarongai in Kajiado County. This is during the anti-government protests. This as 19 others sustained gunshot injuries across the country. Residents woke up in shock after the police infiltrated their streets. As if this could stop them from protesting, this is a picture cue of how areas like Eldoret, Machakos, Mombasa, Nakuru, people marched in numbers with the urge of practicing their democratic rights. Faith in President Ruto. He can't tell us that he's now withdrawing and apologizing and people have been killed. People have been maimed. We have families who are now distraught. Their livelihoods have been destroyed. Their lives have been destroyed. Infrastructure has been destroyed. You can't tell us now that it is when you now want to solve it. Haukutia sahihi iyo finance bill. Na sisi tunajua vizuri sana. After 21 days, it shall automatically become a law. Sisi si wajinga kama umemaanisha kabisa kabisa unataka hiyo bill isifanye kazi sema umetupilia mbali hiyo bill with the hopes for a peaceful demonstration the situation became dire in Homa Bay County after a misunderstanding between the police and the protesters where 11 people were severely injured as of now we've received eight patients um, all of them uh, Five, six of them gunshot wounds. There are two who say they were pushed and a motorbike ran over them. But even as we speak, I have just been called to dispatch an ambulance to pick three other people who have also been injured. In Mombasa County, the protest seemed peaceful only for people to start vandalizing properties. When you want to join Saizi, we are seeing things that we do not want to see as the peaceful youths of this county. We do not want to join Siju and Metumwa and Kinanani that are trying to cause chaos. Do not associate that with us as the youth who started this from day one. However, counties like Embu were peaceful after the police dispersed the protesters using tear gas. Anastasia Mkabi, TV 47.